So tell us about your, your year. Well, my year has been full of a lot of amazing adventures, amazing people who have been really been pushing me in the Distinguished Young Woman program. I've had the opportunity to go to all the third grade classes in the county and talk about the Be Your Best Self program, which really promotes, you know, being healthy and being active in your community and really being the best person that you can possibly be. You know, back at Christmas time, I was in the parades and I got to do some cookies with Santa Claus at the library. And it was so much fun to see all these little bitty kids come in and get their first books of Santa Claus for the first time. It was Truly an amazing experience. On May 21st this year at Bryan College in Red Auditorium, we'll be having the 2017 Distinguished Young Woman Program, and I am so excited to hand this amazing experience down to a new young woman who will go on to do great things with her life, as all the participants in the program will do amazing things as well. And I'm very excited for this year's upcoming Distinguished Young Woman. What was uh, probably your favorite? Thing that you did. My favorite Anyone? time with the Distinguished Young Woman was actually at State back in June. I've met some of my best friends throughout the program. The woman, young woman who actually won State was my roommate, and so it was really great to share that experience with her. And in June this year, I will be heading down to Mobile, Alabama to watch her in nationals. Okay. So what's, what's up for you now going forth? And, uh... Going forward for me, after I hand off my title, I will actually be attending Auburn University in the fall where I will major in journalism with a focus in sports. And I am very, very excited to start my journey in my career. And why Auburn? Why Auburn? Why not Auburn? It's actually the family school. I'm a third generation Auburn Tiger. That's... My grandfather, my mother, my uncle, and my sister all have attended there and I decided to follow in their footsteps. Good. Thank you very much. That was...